Well, here I am at home, as you should be, to be safe and stay healthy through all this. And so, um, thought I'd take a break from my home movies of St. Joe that there doesn't seem to be a load of interest in, and uh, do something there is a load of interest in, and that, namely, something train-related here while I'm at home. And so I thought we'd do an unboxing of this new kit from Bar Mills. T.J. Riley's here in HO scale. They have it in several scales. And right now, Bar Mills is doing free shipping if you're here in the U.S. I ordered this on a Friday and got it the following Monday. By the way, all this is, of course, paid for. Nothing subsidized here um, uh, to to sully, to bias my independent voice. Yeah, it came, I ordered it Friday, came on a Monday. And this is inspired by George Alios, Franklin and South Manchester, famous train layout, inspired by his hometown up in Fitchburg, Massachusetts. And so, of course, it comes with... Um, you know, great details about the parts and how to do it and how to paint things and the sub-assemblies and um, so forth. I can't really turn these pages fast enough, but they're very thorough. They are. Uh, and so we see here that, uh, of course, you get, uh, with the T.J. Riley's, you get the standard wallpaper, uh, I'm sorry, not wallpaper, but roofing paper that you can spray paint black. And then, of course, it's a mere peel and stick to, um, to apply it to the roof of a building. You have, of course, the, the wood that you have to be very careful about staining or else you'll find that if it's not braced first, you'll end up with something like this, as I did um, on my uh, tire repair shop. doesn't quite show up so bad on the front, but it is kind of warped. Then, also, they uh, include these uh, nice formed um, sidewalk pieces looking like old, worn-out, decrepit sidewalks that I have stumbled and staggered down in times past. With a little weathering, those could look really, really great, of course. Nothing says an industry like pipes and, and you know, special industrial sorts of accessories. And then in a new thing from, uh, from Bar Mills, they, they're including some Woodland Scenics figures here that are, you know, as you can see, very well done. It's a road crew, all posing as though they're doing work in the tradition of, uh, and <laughs> um, the road is not included. You have to supply your own road, as in life. And, but anyway, then of course the metal castings, um, some of which have been in other kits, some I haven't seen before, and in the bar mills kits, a fence, wooden fence, telephone poles, oh, more. And you see what I mean about the sidewalk that there's, there's, you know, you could, there's some real texture there, um, 3D depth. And while we're on the topic of bar mills, you know, if you're ordering from them while they're doing the free, free um, uh, shipping, you might want to get there the Bar Mills Rooftop Entry Kits. Their twin pack of, uh, I'll show you what, the, their the twin roof entry kits. There's two in a kit. Huh, that's why it's a twin. And uh, you see there it is with a, it, it actually comes looking like this. You know, in the bar mills tradition, you make this. And uh, I added a notch. The notch has a very nice little accessory set of plants that would, um, I added there to the roof. But elsewise, it's all, that's the, the roof accessory set. It's all bar mills. And on a Foscali 
F-O-S-C-A-L-E Fuscali kit of a <laughs> chemical film shop. Something you never find anymore. Anyway, well, I highly recommend Bar Mills and Fiscali for that matter. For those of you who are home and looking for a good model kit to work on. And uh, stay safe. Happy modeling. See you again with uh, another um, HO building kit. Uh, I'll be reviewing a Walther kit next.